What's up, you guys? So, today, we'll be doing another unboxing video. Alright, so we're unboxing a tripod right now. So, it's a really cheap tripod, which is good, because I need a cheap tripod. This is not for my cameras or lights or anything. It's for a stand to put my green screen on. Okay, so first of all you get like this phone thing, phone holder, and then there's a really cheap tripod that's probably going to break if I use it on a camera. So guys, if you want to use it on a camera, do not, not get it because this is literally going to break in a few days. Oh my gosh. Okay, there you go. Um, it looks nice, but it's just not durable enough. If you've seen the reviews... I mean, some might be good, but probably not. Hold on. So here's a quick release plate. Right here. I I think it's a quick release plate. Oh, no, no, no. So you basically, if you want to use it for a phone or anything, here's this thing. Um, you put it on here, right? Alright, you see, you put it on this plate, and... You turn it around, and you see there's this knob thing, or whatever it's called. You just, um, spin this. Um, I think I, I need an actual spot to film next time. This is really uncomfortable. But, so basically, this is what it looks like now. Um, get the camera, there we go. So, this is what it looks like. You can... You know, loosen this part. You know, it can spin around like this. Really cheap. Probably. It's just bad. Just don't get it. If you want to use it for a camera. I got one of this. It fell off a table. Leg broke. Like, what? How does that even happen? I don't get it. Here. One sec, guys. And then, I believe we can make this go higher somehow. I don't know. And there's a ton of these screw thingies. Alright, if you guys have a tripod, this is my recommendation. Um, there you go. Now it's tight. It's good for your cell phones. It's not gonna, you know, be bad for cell phones. I just needed this to put on my green screen, so. I have one cheap tripod. I need another one. So that's basically it. It's just kind of cheap. I don't think you can. You should get it for filmmaking, unless you want to use your phone in your movies. It's quite nice. It can extend quite a bit. Um, obviously, I don't need to do that right now because it's kind of obvious it can extend. If you don't, I mean, like these things are pretty good, but um, the tripods I use, it's like this heavy duty tripod. I don't know what's the brand. I forgot the name. Of Maybe put it in the description. I might forget, so. Um, don't try to, you know, hate because of that. But, um, I know a really good company that's really nice. For, no! Oh! Oh my god! Oh! This thing, it was like right here, I think, or something. And it was gonna fall down, and I caught it in midair. It was super, ow. Oh, it was super close to the ground. Oh my god, that was that was pretty cool. So, um, the company of tripod I would recommend is I need better lighting next time. So the better the company I recommend would be Manfrotto. It's like this really good tripod company. Um, I have two of those there of their tripod. The one, the compact action tripod I am filming on right now. Hold on. There you go. Mm. Okay. Um, this tripod I'm filming on, and I have another tripod. It's the uh, this tripod. It I use this for vlogging. If you want to see my vlogs, Giant TV. Probably gonna be in the description if I remember. So, yeah, this is the way to go.